Hello everyone, welcome to this video where we are going to solve a simultaneous word problem. Well, the steps will be to define the two variables. We usually use x and y. Um, and after which, form a simultaneous equation using the information given. After which, we solve this information and then answer the word problem. So let's see. Ah. So we are given Li Ting is X years old, father is Y years old. In five years' time, Li Ting's father will be three times. Okay. As old as Li Ting. So in this case here, right? This is what we are going to do. In five years time, what will be Li Ting's age? Currently is X. Five years later, X plus five. And his father will be Y plus five. And so the first equation would be for Li Ting. This Y plus five is how many times? three times as old so you will see mr tan writing this first equation out from here the first equation is y plus five is three times of x plus five four years ago what happened well four years ago her father was six times as old as her. So knowing that, then you will see that Mr. Tan, using this information given, four years ago, Li Ting is X minus four. His father is Y minus four. So with this piece of information, you can then see that this Y minus four, the father is six times the age of Li Ting. And I got my two equation. Right? So the next step is for us to continue to simplify the equation so that it's easier for us to solve. Okay? So the blue color, I'm going to start with this. And I'm going to simplify the equation out. This will be 15. So y minus 3x, I minus 3x on both sides, will be equal to 15 minus 5, I minusing 5 on both sides. So I got my first equation. I'm going to do the same for my y okay so i'm going to just write it here so it's easier and neater for us starting with y minus 4 is equals to 6 times x minus 4 dating's age repeating simplifying this i will get this negative 24 i'm going to minus 6x on both sides I'm going to add 4 on both sides. To get my second equation. And now it's for us to solve this equation and I saw something. Yeah. I saw that the y coefficient is the same. And so this is for us to think a little bit. Whether do we want to plus or minus this equation? So I have a positive y and a positive y. What do I do to then? Do I plus or do I minus such that I get 0? Yes, y minus y equals to 0. 
and so this is what we are going to do next I will have my first equation minusing my second equation y minus y will be 0 I have a negative 3x this is important this is negative 3x I also have a negative 6x so I'm going to minus away my negative 6x I have a positive 10 and I have a negative 20 and so continue to solve negative 3x minus negative 6x is the same as negative 3x plus 6x this will give me positive 3x 10 minus negative 20 is the same as 10 plus 20 so this will give me 30 so I will be able to get that my x is 3 where x would be Li Ting's h now okay and they need to want to know their present age so Li Ting is 10 years old and once I know this I will then be able to get my y as well because all I have to do is to substitute this value of x into either equation 1 or 2 I'm going to substitute into equation 1 Equation 1 is y minus 3x equals to 10. And I know my x. x is 10. Meaning that I'm no longer going to write as x. I'm going to write as 3 times 10. So from here, y minus this will be negative 30 equals to 10 final answer I need to add 30 on both sides y equals to 40 and now we do need to always make sure that we check the answers so I'm going to substitute x and y into the equation 2 so equation 2 is y minus 6x equals to negative 20, right? So now that I have my x and y, I shall replace my y with 40, my x with 10. And does this give me negative 20? Yes, it does. And so we have successfully checked our answers. These two answers are correct. Okay, with that, we've come to the end of this video where we found out that Li Ting is 10 years old and the father is 40 years old. We have come to the end of this video. If you like this video, do give it a thumbs up. Thank you for watching and have a nice day.